Hey guys, I'm Skull Girl, and this is the fourth day for Terror Tuesday, and we will be playing four games. Um, for the first game, we have Mannequin, which you can find on both Itch.io and Steam, I believe. Um, so yeah, let's get right into the video. This door isn't at all what I pictured. Okay. Um, excuse me, but it shouldn't matter if I bought these clothes three months ago. So cursed. And this door as well. Girl, if you don't... I don't like customers like you, Ro. Okay, you're gonna care to make any more headaches. Go home up, will you? Real. Alright. Let's collect my keys. Man, I did not get paid enough. Girl, you're doing all this? I don't get paid enough for this, man. Why are things like um set up like a like a thrift store uh, not thrift store, uh, like a maze? Excuse me. Whoa, no, 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 no. Oh, crap. Oh my god. Now I have sniffles. And mannequins on my ass. No, thank you. Break room. Of course it's locked. Ooh. A. Hey. I don't like that I have to go back that way. Everything's set up like a maze. Like, <gasps> what was that? Hello? Hey girly, you're not gonna you're not gonna attack me, are you? Crap 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 No 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 I'm afraid Which one of you? Which one of you was it? Was it you? Hmm? Okay, cool. What is this? Safe house? Safe room. I'm not feeling well today. Might as well take the day off. My joints are killing me. So you get a day off and I don't. Why do I need paper clips? Oh, maybe I can unlock the stuff. The lock pick it. Hey ma'am, do you know how to lock pick for me? Don't don't go and hurt me, okay? I'll just do my rounds now. Wrong way. Nope, nope, nope. Leave it. Leave me alone, you creep. No. Can you stay over there, lady? This is, um, ma'am, you're in my way, ma'am. I hope it's you that is the only one. Well, why would I need paper clips? You know, I truly do not get paid enough for this. How about you, ma'am? You know what I'm supposed to be doing. Did I, like, overlook something? Oh, you moved too, didn't you? Did I, like, completely miss a door or something? Three mannequins. Three mannequins are out and about right now. Four? Damn. Starting a party over here. 
Hello, ma'am. I'm gonna need you to stay there for a moment. Got it? So I can... Oh, maybe I'm supposed to open the restroom? Why don't we bring up... Well, yeah. But how do I... Hell yeah. Why am I in the bathroom exactly? Ah. Keys. Um. Ma'am, you have no reason for being in the bathroom. Um, the store is closed. We have funky hair, dog. A. Mm mm. Crap. Okay, 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 okay. That's a different one. Why do y'all look the same? Wait, why did I? I'm so dumb. This key's probably for the electrical place. Ooh, I thought I ran into something. Can I close the door? Nope. Girl, if you don't leave the store. Tomorrow. Real. Yeah, you don't get paid enough for this lady. Ooh, I don't like this. Oh my freaking god. Nope. Mm. Mm. I'm outie, I'm outie, I'm outie. You can't run as fast as me. Oh my freaking god. How did I get to the back rooms? I can't escape. I can't escape the back rooms. I really cannot. Well, here we are. And the TV? It's over. Ma'am, I'm looking directly at you. This is for real, like, retail um, hell right now for this lady. Please don't have an asthma attack. Crap. Hey! How y'all doing? She's missing. Uh uh. I was fully not expecting something like this. I was expecting having to just exit my my job. Beep beep beep. Beep, beep, beep. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Ugh. Yuck. No, 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 no. Please let me exit. What do I do? What do I? Is this not the exit? <laughs> oh 
<laughs> I don't like this. This poor lady. She can't run as far, man. Let her rest. Crap. Where are you coming from? I don't. This is not the exit. How do I... Come to the exit. Now can I leave? Can you leave? Oh my freaking god. <gasps> leave me alone. What the hell? How do, how do I leave? Oh. I missed this. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Please don't, please don't, please don't, please don't. <gasps> Is this not the exit? Oh. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Please. Oh my freaking god. Uh -uh. No! Does that mean she dies at the end? Ooh, that was creepy. I kind of like that we got put into the back rooms. But it also reminded me, like, if you're in, like, a big mall, and then there's that one little area of just nothing. That's what that reminded me of. Well, that was the mannequin. Um, that is the first game out of four. Um... On to the next one. This is the second game. It is called Gavril. I'm gonna say Gavril. Gavril. Yes, yes, it is basically a visual novel, a horror visual novel. I had to do at least one within the days. This is the one I chose because it's a simple one and the art style looked cool. Um, but this is Gavril. Gavril? Gavril? I hope I'm saying that right. Gav this is Gavril. This is on Itch.io. Let's get started. What is your name? Scar Girl. Enter. You wake up to a loud crash downstairs. Sounds like something broke. If you could blame this on a pet or a sibling, that would be great. And you could go right back to sleep. Unfortunately, you live entirely alone. Damn real i don't even have a dog no cat damn you have no choice but to check it out i do actually <laughs> go back to sleep mm, i'll go downstairs in reality i would go back to sleep and pretend like nothing happened you climb out of bed with your phone and fetch the baseball bat out of your closet for good measure you make your way downstairs pretty confident in your ability to maneuver through the house in the dark but the minute your foot touches the bottom of the stairs, you find it stuck in something. No matter how much you pull something around, your shoe only pulls back. You're scared to put your other foot down, and you're unable to walk any further to turn to the living room lights. Don't move, stay silent, say something. Phone flashlight! You hold your phone in front of you. And activate the flashlight, eliminate, em, illuminating your surroundings. Wait, is homie like... Is he like inked or something? He's inked. You weren't sure what you were expecting, but... Aule? I don't know. I, oh, I'm not even gonna try to pronounce that again. That is indeed a whole ass man in front of you. <laughs> you notice whatever you were stepping on, retreat on retreats and crawl crawls away from you. You take the opportunity to swing the bat right for his head. Oh, whoops. The man collapses. Oh, oh, he wakes back up in the dining hall. Huh? Huh? I'm alive? He seems pleasantly surprised. You weren't exactly looking to commit manslaughter, but if you swung any harder and at the right spot, you might have. 
Unfortunately for him, you are more curious for answers than anything. He may just have to live with a concussion for a bit. You observe him slightly as he takes his time to fully wake up and process the predicament he's in. <laughs> he struggles to move where he is. Thanks to the zip ties around his wrists. Man's got hit with a bat. You must really want to talk to me. Are you lonely? Hey man, just because I don't have a pet in my house. What the hell are you talking about? No. You took the time to tie me up, didn't you? If I didn't, you would still be doing God knows what in my house. Real. Little dog, don't be looking at me like that. But I am still in your house. <laughs> this guy sucks. Why haven't I called the cops yet? You fiddle with your phone on your lap. Hoping the stranger doesn't notice. You're going to call the cops, aren't you? I'm surprised you hadn't already. You really are lonely. Damn! God, he just keeps on talking. You look down at your phone as you're. Oh, you look down at your phone as you're so close to dialing 911. So close. But if you did, you wouldn't be able to find out what's wrong with this guy. <laughs> Why he's in your house of all places. So, you put the phone down. Wise decision, my friend. Hmm. I guess I can't call you my friend yet if I don't know you. Your name. Is your strain what if this stranger was going to entertain your questions you figure the last thing you should do is make him upset it's skull girl well skull girl i'm gavril i would love to shake your hand right now but well i don't think i want to touch your hand after seeing all the na that nasty shit around you <laughs> what is that or from you you shudder at the idea of that stuff being inside him. Oh, don't mind all that. It's hard to explain what it is, really. But you don't have to worry about it. For as long as I am satisfied. Does this man have, like, um... Like those Slenderman t type beat? Where it's kind of like a shadow, I guess? Promise. I don't have to worry about that because you're tied up, right? Hmm, are you satisfied right now, bro? Are you gonna kill me? We have a feeling you know the answer to this already. It would be more satisfying to if you untied me. This position is very uncomfortable. I'm gonna do that. This is for the best, you hope. You won't regret this. <laughs> you hope even harder. <laughs> You regu- Ooh. Oh, you reluctantly get up to grab a pair of scissors and cut the zip tie around Gavril's wrist. He immediately stretches his arms above his head and takes off his hood to fully reveal his face. Ah, so much better. Thank you, Skull Girl. If it's a chat you want, it's a chat you'll get. Cool. Okay. <laughs> I mostly just need to know. Why did you break into my house? A friend led me here. We're both pretty hungry, so he might have smelled something good. I don't know where he he's run off to. Now that I think about it. Wait, there's more of you? It's not, comf oh, it's not comforting to know you're house is a potential buffet oh he and i are nothing alike for one he is a rat a rat <laughs> all right you are friends with a rat he got remy on his head bro you about to start chefing it up wait i remember you had a tail just like a rat what are you talking about <laughs> what do you mean by that 
He takes a moment to process what you, you might mean. Oh, you mean my... That's not a tail, it's more like a third arm. He does have slender man type B. Not that there is anything wrong with tails, or rats having tails. Hey, don't worry. It's a nice look on you. <laughs> it's really weird, honestly. No, 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 no. It's cool, bro. <laughs> Thank you. It does make stealing food easier. Yeah. You are not taking anything from my fridge. You don't have to steal anything, bro. Bro, you could have just knocked on my door and said, Hey, I'd like some food. <laughs> Maybe save some f for your friend, too. Whatever he is. Oh, I'll get you something to eat. You are too kind, Skullgirl. Fruit? This guy clearly needs nutritious. Cheese. He is friends with a rat. Jeez. You head to the fridge to take out a plate of cheese and set it on the table with, in front of him. He immediately lunges for it to dig in. Damn. Oh, I love cheese. How did you know? Just a hunch. <laughs> in an instant, the cheese is gone. He, he was starving. Ah, I forgot to save some for my friend. It's okay. If I see him around, I'll give him some too. You're not sure if you really mean that. So, why are you breaking into homes for food? By the sounds of it, you might be the lonely one here, considering who he's friends with. <laughs> Can you blame me? I'm a hungry guy with no money. Men are real. <laughs> There are so many ways to get a free meal that isn't just stealing from someone's fridge. I prefer to- Ooh. I prefer to do it the fun way. Well, tonight wasn't fun for you, was it? Getting tied up and all. No. It was still fun. I got cheese after all. <laughs> you made me very happy, Skullgirl. Well, isn't that nice? Still, a feeling nags at you that you are incredibly lucky to be in this position unharmed. So, all that sl uh, slimy- Oh my god. So, all that slimy stuff. Do you control it or- Yes, it's been so useful to me, but it's hard to say- if it is a tool or a friend sometimes. Pity. Pity that this pity that this guy has such a rap oh oh my god. Pity that this guy has such a warped perception of friendship. For a moment you entertain the idea to unironically be his friend. Before you quickly snap back oh snap snap yourself back to rationality. Snap back to reality. Oh yeah, wait. He, he barged into my house. <laughs> so does it keep you company? Can you communicate with him? <laughs> I'm not sure, honestly. I'm not sure, honestly. Oh, wait. Whoops. Um, it's not easy to tell if it can feel anything but hunger. Wait, what? Skullgirl, I have to go soon. I have a lot of traveling left to do, but I don't mind. Oh, but I don't mind that I made a pit stop here for cheese. Alright, I won't keep you any longer. Gavril gets up and makes his way to the front door. You watch him with an uneasy expression, but you suppose he has no reason to stay and continue to intimidate you. I don't know how to say that. I'm just gonna assume that means bye. Bye, skull girl. Maybe we will cross paths again in the future. I want to count on it. You nervously wave goodbye and breathe a sigh of relief, knowing the hell uh, will soon be over. You're shocked. You're even still alive. Best of all, you can finally go back to sleep. Yippee, I was spared. Although now I gotta see. 
I need only to see the jump scares. Because there is some. Pee, pee, poo, poo. Uh, I'm going to say we go back to sleep. It's probably nothing. Close your eyes and doze off. You don't wake up again. <laughs> Ending one. Instant death. No, real. <laughs> Since I keep saying it. Let's say something. Hey, whoever's out there, get the hell out. Please. <laughs> There's a moment of silence after you kind of stupidly called out to whoever it, or whatever it could be in your house. <laughs> the silence is broken. Oh, the silence is broken by a chuckle heard not so far away from you. Only comfort. Um, uh, confirming. Oh my god. What now? Don't move. Use. Use your light. So this is all pretty much the same. Mm hmm. Plus, hit him with the maybe. So you are. Well, I'm here to keep you company. If you untie me, I'm sure I can reward your honesty. <coughs> what kind of reward? There's only one way for you to find out. This guy sucks. <laughs> Why haven't I called the cops yet? You fiddle with your phone on your lap, hoping to the stranger doesn't notice. You're going to call the cops, aren't you? I'm surprised you hadn't already. You are so lonely. It's okay. Um, I don't have to worry about that because you're tied up, right? That is true. I guess I can still show you what it is. What it is even in this uncomfortable position. Show you? You shake your head. No, no. That's not necessary. You don't have to show me that goopy stuff again. <laughs> Just tell me about it. What is it? I already told you. I don't know how to describe it. Here. Just watch closely. <gasps> watch. You look frantically around the room, unsure of what to immediately realize. Then you realize. You look under the table at your feet, only to see that pitch black bass crawl towards you. It slides under your shoes and curls around them and then up your legs. You begin to kick at them at a panic and attempt to get up from your seat, but you're stuck. Stop. Get it away from me. How are you doing that? I think you know what to do to make it stop. No. You can't let him scare you like this. You grab your phone and immediately dial 911. You continue to kick at the mass in the process. Hello? <laughs> Hello, police! I'm going. <laughs> it's a weed! Is that a weed? Hello, police. Um, please help. There's an intruder in my house. I'm like, what? You were so focused on the phone and on the black sludge making its way up your body. You don't even notice Gavril? Gavril. Right next to you, snatching the phone out of your hand. He's out of his restraints? Question mark? He hangs up the phone call and drops the phone onto the floor. How did you? You will find out soon. What? You look down at yourself, shocked to see the black mass has covered most of your body now, having reached your torso and creeping towards your neck. You try to move, but to your shock, you have lost all feeling in your limbs. It was hard to tell where they began or ended while coated like this. Everything felt numb. This paralyzes me, dog. It's like a, it's like a poison, bro. He poisoned me. <laughs> You're paralyzed, watching yourself slowly consumed by the substance. What is happening to me? You're helping it grow. Real. <laughs> Wait, I forgot. You're helping it grow real. I guess this is another way to satisfy me. Or rather, it. Very cryptic. Explanation out of Gra Gavril. Gavril. Makes you want to puke. You can't seem to fill your stomach anymore, anyway. The mass reaches you. You. 
The mask reaches your face and continues to cover every surface inch of your head, muffling your pleases and obscuring your view of Gavril. The feeling is suffocating, and you figure with the last moments of consciousness that you are no longer yourself. Delayed fate. I was ending two, so I got one, two, put in my normal name. Okay. Speed run. Go downstairs. We'll untie him real quick. So what if I give him fruit? Um, let's save that one. Food note. Um, you're not taking anything from my fridge. Especially not after you broke that vase. You don't seem to seem like someone who can pay that back. But I haven't eaten all day. You said you'd keep me satisfied. And you promised you wouldn't be in, uh, you wouldn't be any trouble if I untied you, which I did. So stop complaining. You untie me and leave me hungry? Are you sure about that, Squirrel? Huh? And the more you think about it, you suppose the implications aren't exactly in your favor. Well, you're not a cannibal, right? No, I would not label myself as that. Is he one? Gavril seems to read your mind as he watches you slowly get out of your seat. Revenous. He ate me! Cannibal! One, two, three, four. We have four endings. Which I think there were six endings. Do that one again. Um, Don't. I'm gonna call the cops. Let me just... Get some scissors in the other room. I'll be right back. Other room? Scarbo. There are already scissors in this room. I can see them right there. Oh, haha. <laughs> You're right. Let me get those then. Your heart is pounding. You did not think that through. Wait. Why are you so nervous? It's not like he could do anything. Tied up like that. You're perfectly safe. Aren't you? You take a deep breath and get up. Or try to, but anyway, your feet can't move. Wait, hold on. What the hell, man? I'm trying to get the scissors. How are you doing that? Stop. I think you know what to make it stop. Um, okay, call the police. We just, okay, we did have this ending. Skip. Okay, let's get him something. Let's, let's, let's give him fruit. Let's see what happens. You head to the fridge to take out a bowl of fruit and set it on the table in front of Gavril. He holds the apple in his hands and- Oh. What the fuck? Oh my god! I assume that's supposed to say rolls. His tongue rolls out to lather it in the same black stuff that has been tormenting your curiosity all this time. It's such a gross sight, but you can't seem to look away. You watch the goo entirely coat the apple, and in a matter of seconds, it's gone. Gavril withdraws his tongue back into his mouth. Why didn't you eat it like a normal person? Apples are hard to chew. <laughs> it's easier this way. What about the banana? You want to watch me eat a banana? <laughs> what? Uh, never mind. <laughs> anyway... You actually use, use, oh my god. Anyway, you actually use the black smile to eat things? Slime. Black slime, not smile. I, I can read guys, trust me. Gabriel only grins back, answering your question. The only thing you can think about is how you were stepping on that stuff not too long ago. You could end up just like that apple. How does it work? Is it, like, acidic? Hmm, no. I don't think it melts things exactly, but it kind of works like that. It's so hard to explain. I am not a scientist, but my cousin is practically one, so I'm sure he would know. He is very smart. I'm assuming your family doesn't know about all this yet. Family is a strong word. It isn't a strong word. It's literally what cousins are not in good standing with them huh i can see why 
I don't think that's your business. You literally broke into my house, bro. <laughs> You're a felon. Of course your family doesn't like you. You aren't making chatting very fun. That is what you wanted to do, yes? Look, I just don't see why I have to cater to you when you're the one trespassing, trespassing on my property because you are afraid of me. Yes, I am scared to death that you can eat me with your goop thing. I don't think I can learn anything more about that from you. How about leave, alright? Peacefully? We both have what we want. Now go. Hmm, that's fair. He gets up from the table and slowly t makes his way to the front door. Your breath of relief. <laughs> the hell was over. Oh. For a moment anyway, before you're blacked out from the swing of the baseball bat. You wake up to discover your wallet missing <laughs> and your fridge raided the food. I got robbed as an ending. I liked my first ending. We got robbed, instant death, the good ending. I feel like we have. I think we did to get all the endings. If not, then I can fix that. But, um, that was Gav- Gavril? That was Gavril. It is on Ichio. Um, and yeah. It was a fun little play. I liked having my first ending first, though. Anyway, on to the next game. Alright, so this is the third game. It is called Last Night, and it is on Ichio as well. Let's get started. Play June 12, 2008. This is my first day of work at this restaurant. Press any key to continue. To get to the place of work, do I gotta take the bus? Or do I just gotta walk? Why am I walking so slow? You know, I was, if I was in this situation, donut shop, I would not be walking this slow. Hello? Can you let me in? Who would do that? Outdoor sign? Oh, okay. Clear the workplace of debris and put it in order. Oh. Throwing away the rubbish. So someone's. Uh oh, I thought it was a pack of cigarettes. Can oh. Can this go in here? I don't know. Oh. Oh, I don't know what to do with this box. <coughs> Put the box down. Here we go. Well, that's the exit. Am I supposed to put the trash in here? I just realized. I'm gonna need to turn you off. I don't need you right now. You're adding to the creepy ambiance. Why is there so much trash back here? 
but like the actual rubbish bags I can't put in there. never do a closing shift. Frick this. Nope. In I go. Oh, do I have to put stuff on my... No? Do I still have rubbish? Huh? Well, no. What else trash do I have? Do I gotta put that away? <laughs> oh. I didn't see this here. There, oh, no. There we go. Sit. Huh? Set it. Put it in order. Girl. Cute. Oop. R. Oh no, damn it. Well, I accidentally restarted my game. Well, maybe I missed something, so let's just. Oh! That's probably why I didn't go through. There we go. It has to make the rubbish noise. Yay! As I get so up close and personal with the the trash. There we go. Where's the external signage? Oh. I didn't know that. Serve all customers by processing fulfilling orders. How do we know the orders? Don't yell at me, dog. What you like? How's it? What you what you got up on you? Burger, green donut, purple donut. Purple donut. Shut up. Purple donut. Green donut. That's fine. They're not gonna know. This dude's honking, like, bro, chill. There we go. Shut up, dude. There. Leave. Get out of my face. Mm -mm -mm. Let's put these patties on. I'm just gonna pretend like that's cooking. for later we should have gave that other customer the the one with the oh no the one with the um the floor meat I lost my other one how do we um
what kind of what kind of meal is this? A burger, meat, milk, and and pink donut. Shut up, dude. Look, I dropped your order because of you. Leave. What am I supposed to do when I need more meat? Oh, make a trip to warehouse for meat. Where's that at? Is that this way? Can I go out this way? Excuse me, rat. You're in my way. Where the hell is the warehouse? It's here. Oh, yeah. Where it says warehouse. Um. So, do I just take this? You were last seen the day you disappeared, and since then, oh, you can read the rest. <laughs> Pause and read. Why are you still here in the game? It's already over. To return to menu. I wonder, if I play again, does anything happen? Oh, you can't even. Damn. Well. Wow. That was last night. Um, that was uh, fast food hell instead of retail hell. Anyway, on to the next game. This is fourth week, fourth game. It's Five Nights at Freddy's, the ultimate night, because it's, it's got everyone. This is because the movie is coming out this week on Friday the 27th. What if I do it to five? No, 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 no. Yeah, we're doing three. So this is fourth game for the fourth day for Terror Tuesday. And it's FNAF themed because obviously we're doing the classic, classic little dudes. Actually, I think five is the normal set for them in the game, in theory. So I'll do them five. And then hope that I don't die. I'm gonna suck badly at this game. Or, 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 or. I don't know how to do the camera. I forgot. Freaking Bonnie. Oh, I just saw a coin. We're gonna die. What is Bonnie in? I think it was. <laughs> hey, we're dick for dag! that one. No! Can homie leave my door? Oh, there goes Foxy. You're still there, bro? Well, there, there he 
he goes. You know, Bonnie, I'm gonna need you to leave my area. <gasps> Damn, already? This is what I get. Or, 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 or. You know, how do people do this? Hello, Fedu Fosbear? You're not gonna do a little jingle for me? Oh, he's most definitely gonna. Hello. What if I just somehow made it through three till six? Six a.m. in the game. How did that get me so? Oh, he was added. I don't know how he does it. He makes his way. I don't know much. I don't remember the the uh, the these guys. I just know the basic ones mostly. I don't like all this ones. The frog, the hippo, all those guys. I don't know how they work. I mean, I watched gameplay, but I don't know how they work. Okay. No. How do I do my light? Freaking Bonnie. Why am I checking the vents? I don't need to do that. Horror, 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 horror. Who's rummaging in the, in the kitchen? Oh, there goes Freddy. Jar, me bird likes you, so I'll do ye a favor. I'm just gonna keep doing power because I'm bad at it. Freddy Freddy Fazbear and then for people to proceed to do commentary while playing f Five Nights at Freddy's in those crazy modes nah could you leave bro don't har 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 in my ear dog what if I honk at him homie's just sitting there Excuse me. That was not fair. I don't even get the jingle. Hello? Fay Fazbear, I know you were there. <laughs> You're telling me battery goes out that fast? There's no way, sir. Uh-oh, how unfortunate. Uh-oh, how unfortunate. Where did Chica come from? What the hell? Uh-oh, how unfortunate. Uh-oh. Oh, that's Chica. I'm so dumb. Of course she would be in the freaking kitchen, dog. Which, I think Chica... Okay, so you're four. Oh, I freaking god. I hate so much Bonnie. You know that? Oh no, oh no, how do 
do I get rid of this? Survive at least one night. Five nights at Freddy's. That's where I want to be. Am I tripping? Why is there no like. There's not stacks. There's like no stage. Wait, no. Wait, that would make sense. Also, this little clown mixed with Marinette over here, bro. The puppet. Marinette. And the puppet is freaky. G no, I missed the bird because of the stupid mask. It's in my way. But look at it. The puppet and then mixed with this little dude. It's terrifying. Oh, he doesn't haunt. Still gonna be sitting there. Let me know when you're close by, homie. Aw, oh, Foxy's out. Damn it. I'm gonna get- <laughs> Foxy's gonna get me. Get back in your spot, Foxy. Yar, you win- Yar, you play with fire and sometimes you get burned. Wait, why did he get me and not the a normal Foxy? Huh? Hello, hello, hello. Is that what I'm missing? I should put him to one at least. Do, 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 do. Why does Freddy have two eyebrows? Oh, it's like, look at him. He has, he has four eyebrows. He has two sets. A set of two. Oh no. Um I think he comes in. Freaking Damn you. Jar, me bird likes you. So I'll do ye a favor. Get back in your spot, Foxy. Yeah. No. What? D did I break my game? Um, I broke my game. I'm in an infinite loop of jump scares. All right. Oh wait, no, I forgot Foxy. Wait, where's my lights? Oh, Z is my lights. Um, how do I exit this? she added oh mangle damn <laughs> till 10 you're crazy she said you forgot foxy but don't worry i'm gonna give you another fox like uh oh how unfortunate uh oh how unfortunate beep 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 i wonder if they did anything for the the newest FNAF in this game. Oh, probably not. Maybe maybe like a little map they did. <gasps> Bonnie, always messing up my stuff, Bonnie. For a fast bear. <coughs> this dude takes 500 years to get to his door, bro. And then he takes 500 years to leave. Like, I don't... 
I really don't know what you want me to do about it, bro. Uh-oh, how unfortunate. Uh-oh. Oh. Don't move that mask. I don't know what that does. I can't remember. I think that allows me to die at least once. Yeah, oh, oh, I to go. Uh, power, please. Dude, can you leave, bro? Done. I always get to three a.m. I feel like I have to. I have to get one six a.m. I'm so close every time. What if I just sit here for a second? If we do that, does that mean it blocks it off from- Does that mean that- Homie, um... Freaking Foxy can't go in there? <clears throat> That's right, you Foxy. Yar. Stop it. Where- how do you prevent Chico from coming? Frick you. Get away, dog. What was that? Oh no. How do you open it? Just put a fan on him. Does the open duck help? Whoa, homie's just right up there. Yeah, give it. You win some, you lose some. Homie said Yar, you win some, you, you lose some. <laughs> and sometimes you get burned. I just. <laughs> That's a way to go. You win some, you lose some. <laughs> I got to 4 a.m. too. I was so close. I'm gonna do this one. That way, the DV thing. I guess that. There we go. Okay, so I need to wait till. Freaking Freddy is all the way up against the freaking stupid door. And then he can leave me alone. And then for Chica, I changed the thingy. It's been a second since I even watched a FNAF thing. I don't know where Bonnie comes. I know. Oh, wait, no. Bonnie goes into the foxy area. Jar, me bird likes you. So I'll do ye a favor. I'm in intense focus. I must get. Listen to this menacing music over there, Chica. Please, please just let me get the, the, to, to, uh, six, it's at 4 a.m. Yo, why mo? 4 a.m. I need six. Six a.m. Six a.m. Six a.m. Six AM. Six AM. Please, 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 please. Foxy, why? I was I can't run like I used to, but I can pull myself apart just fine. Why would you need to pull yourself apart? I don't understand. Do I have a DB repellent? No, I do not. I'll do that because that wasn't in the first game. Okay, so what if I go the first hour just chilling? 
I don't remember the code. I n wait. One, three. Uh, wait, wait, wait. One, one nine, ninety-eight? Did that give me anything? No. Nope. <coughs> I knew freaking Bonnie was gonna be there. Oh, look, it's a little foxy. Wait. This changes. Does that mean anything? Does that mean that? Oh, does that mean that like f Foxy's in there? If Foxy's there, and then if it's Bonnie, that means Bonnie's there. I think. So that means. Yeah, it's Bonnie's How may I be of service to ya? Yellow, I would like one power, please. Oh, okay. So that means Foxy's in there. Ah. And then Bonnie's in there. <gasps> I'm not Jimmy Anus. <laughs> no, I wasn't paying attention to the freaking cameras. I'm gonna put that DD repellent on. Okay, getting the hang of of this game. Oh, hello, hello, hello. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Freaking Bonnie. I can't wait to watch the movie. That. I really yeah, me bird. hope that I can see it. It is the plan though to go and see it. Curious to see how things would play out. For the movie. So I'll do ye a favor. I would like more power, please. Thank you. Okay, it's getting to the later hours of the game. So that means they want to get rowdy. Come on, Freddy. Jar, the bird likes you. Can't with the 4 a.m. I'm so close. I'm gonna die from Freddy. Promise to never leave. <laughs> Promise to never leave. Uh oh, how unfortunate. Uh oh, how unfortunate. unfortunate. That was right. I'm almost there. Oh, the silence of me just focusing. I wish you could throw the paper balls. Oh yeah. Oh. Yeah, oh yeah. Uh oh, how no. unfortunate. Uh oh, how unfortunate. I know mm -hmm. how much you like to fight, so I'll add a new problem to Here your night. Yarg, how may I be of service to ya? I would like you to take away whoever was at it. Thank you very much. There we go. Here comes Freddy. You stay there. I don't, I don't know who just added. Ugh. I hope they weren't high in number. Where would they even be located? Well, it's Bonnie right now. Vince? Ooh, that was spot on. Me. This one, please. Thank you. Who was at it? <laughs> what is Chica doing in there? Don't 
Don't be laughing in my ear. I'm not the bad guy. I'm just a bit surprising. There's no Char, the <laughs> bird likes you. So I'll do ye a favor. No, get away from me. Stop laughing at me. I assure you, I am very real. No, you're not, because you didn't show up nowhere. <laughs> Till 10. Why does she always put it to 10? Oh my god. It's not worth advertising. Sippy straw, sippy, sippy, sippy straw, sippy, sippy straw. Sippy, sippy straw, sippy straw, sippy, sippy, sippy straw. I think you should have a DS that he could play. Actually, I think there is someone that you could just put into the game. Here comes Freddy. It's not worth it. It's not worth it. Thank you. Or does the cupcake do anything when Chica's out? God damn. <laughs> What can I do for ya? That one sounded more chippier. Freddy, come on, man. Taking up my time, bro. Damn it. It's like the worst time for you to be there. No! I think I broke my game again. I can turn on the desk fan? Oh my god. Huh. <laughs> the fan uses energy? Is that why I kept almost freaking dying, bro? Oh my god. Why would I need that? I'm feeling more confident in this one now that I know that the freaking fan used stupid Yar, energy. Oh, touch me, bird. What can I do for ya? Oh, whoops. Did not mean to do that. Ram. You stay there, Foxy. Jar, me 
bird likes you. So I'll do ye a favor. Five AM, I'm gonna make it. Please. Jar, me bird likes you. So I'll do ye a favor. I did it. Let's go. I got to 6 a.m. and some FNAF. Hell yeah. I'm the FNAF wizard now. Um, because I beat one night. <laughs> So that was, that was ultimate custom night. So that was the one that you can pick any of the, uh, the characters in f the FNAF, like, games, f like, until, um, when they made it. Because, <laughs> obviously, there's more after that. But, that was the final game of the, um, fourth day for Terror Tuesday. It is on steam it's free um i'll put a link down below just like all the other games i will put a link down below into um wherever they might be i believe some are from itch.io and some are from steam it it really just depends um everything will be down in the description down below um if you like the video leave a like subscribe if you like my content leave a suggestion down below if you have any games that you would like to see me play um but yeah that was the fourth fourth day in terror tuesday thank you for watching bye <laughs>